welcome back to a brand new video and welcome to our first potential look at the Pokemon Sword and Shield anime. This is going to be a brand new series on the channel where each week as the episodes come out, we will be reviewing them uh, and of course talking about them and letting you guys know all about it. It's a series that I've wanted to do for a very long time. I just never got around to doing it because I didn't catch up with this on a moon anime, although I am currently watching it now, so I'll try my best uh, to keep you guys updated with the knowledge that I have. But it looks like we've got our first teaser look, I guess. Um, it's still unconfirmed, uh, which, you know, it, it's one of those where I don't really love doing videos on things that aren't, like, confirmed. But in a sense, this kind of looks like it's going to be the thing. It's up on Cerebi. I got it from Cerebi. I was just literally browsing this morning and I had a look. But here is the kind of, like, poster, I guess, in a sense, uh, for the Sword and Shield anime, of course, you can see in the back there, they've got like Snorlax uh, and like the, the tower from the actual map on the Pokemon games, uh, Sword and Shield, representing like Big Ben in England and stuff like that. And then as you go around, it's kind of one of those where it's kind of taking you back um, throughout all the, the Pokemon anime. Of course, we have like Sun and Moon there to the right of it. We have X and Y there. And then of course, we have Black and White, Diamond and Pearl, uh, Ruby and Sapphire. Um, and then, of course, we have the Johto anime as well. So, it, and then the first one, of course, with the Charizard and Gengar and stuff. Uh, and Moltres in the back there, you can see. But it looks really, really dope. And I love the fact that they've done this. It's like, it's like bringing it all together. Like, Sword and Shield is supposed to be a massive thing. Uh, and, of course, it's bringing the whole thing together. So, we take a look at our rival. We see Ash as well. It looks like Ash isn't really keeping the same design that he had in the Sun and Moon anime. Um, if we flip on over to the next picture... Uh, we can see the potential uh, screenshot for what Ash is going to look like in the anime. Of course, he doesn't look like anything he had like in the Sun and Moon anime. He was more like cartoony. Uh, but this one looks pretty dope. I I'm really looking forward to this one. I really love his design on this. One thing that I wish they would have kept for the design, if you guys would have seen the uh, the Pokemon, um, the movie with Lugia, not 2000. Is it the power, the other one? Um, the latest one, I think it is. Um, his design in that was absolutely incredible. He looked so legit. He looked like a proper, like, anime that you'd see, like, today. You know, something brand new coming out. It looked absolutely amazing. But this one, I kind of can mess with it. Um, I did, I did enjoy his design in Sun and Moon. It wasn't one of those things where it was, like, completely bad. Um, but I thought it could have been better. But you kind of get used to it uh, and the whole design aspect of it. But this one looks really, really dope. I love the fact that he's holding the, um, the Rotom phone thing. Uh, that we've seen uh, in trailers and stuff like that for Pokemon Sword and Shield. And then, of course, you can see now uh, his rival that's got a score bunny. And I'm really looking forward to exactly what their, you know, their bond's going to be like in this game. Are they going to be, like, actual rivals? Or, like, Ash going to be like, it was with how? I don't know. It's quite interesting. Um, Cerebi really says that it, it's unconfirmed. Uh, so don't, you know, believe too much. Um, so this is why it's, like, our first potential look, I guess, in a sense. Um, but we do get the announcement revealed on Sunday, I do believe it is. So it's one of those where you have to take it with a pinch of salt. It possibly could be with, with any like, you know, like rumor leak video and stuff like that. It's one of those where you have to take it with a pinch of salt. But looking at this, it does kind of look legit. Uh, so we'll rock with the vibes that it actually is legit. Uh, and we'll wait for the announcement this Sunday. Now, it does look absolutely amazing. If we flip on over to the last picture, of course, we just see, obviously, can't read Japanese or anything like that, but we do see Skull Bunny, uh, Sobble, and Grookey all just chilling, waiting for the announcement. Now, if I do go back to Cerebi, uh, these are the words that are on Cerebi's uh, website. So it says, ahead of the reveal coming on Sunday, an image got shared on a Japanese image board that potentially showcases the first look at the brand new anime for the po series of Pokemon. As revealed before, the series is said to take place in all regions and of the all artwork shows that the promised areas of each region as their Pokemon dotted around the image of Ash and Pikachu and a new character who has a score bunny. Please do note that it is currently unconfirmed. We are currently investigating further and will provide fun, uh, full details as when they come. So be sure to check back on Sunday when there's an official announcement. So basically, uh, the, it's taking place in all of um, the regions, which is so dope. And the poster looks so, you know, if you if you think about that, it, it makes sense now that Ash is here with his rival and then he's got all the regions going around him. I'm really looking forward to see what they can do with this anime. You know, there was a lot of speculation saying Ash wasn't going to be in the anime, but of course he is. There's the poster. It's basically... Like, they wouldn't have the Pokemon anime without Ash. It doesn't make sense. So I, I don't know why that was a thing. So many people believe that Ash wasn't in the anime anymore. Uh, I'm pretty sure something got said and people were believing that he wasn't in the anime, but it, it's, of course it's got to be Ash in the anime. It's Pokemon. It has to be Ash. He finally won his league in Alola. So now he's going out. It's going out. He's ready to take on it all. Um, but it does look really interesting. So I'm really looking forward to it. 
One of the main things I think what I what I want to see from this anime, considering that, you know, the fact that it's taking place in all regions, is being able to like see all of the legendary Pokemon coming into the to the new region. I guess with the fact that it's in Sword and Shield, and it's it's one of those I, I've always said this about the Pokemon anime. Um, it's one of those where I, I really don't understand some aspects of the Pokemon anime. Like some things will happen and I'll never really grasp it. But when I watch through Sun and Moon, everything seemed to like made sense like it, it looked like they were trying a lot more with the anime you know the visuals were so much better the actual like animation like the fights and stuff like that it was all clean i gotta say though x and y again was a great anime i do remember watching that that was really dope but the fact that now this is taking place in every single region i wonder how they're gonna make that work because i've not really i couldn't really imagine the anime being placed in all the regions so it's ash like I, I guess they're gonna have like arcs aren't they like currently like you know if you take, for example, like, Hunter Hunter, they have, like, arcs, like, you know, they've got the, um, the Hunter's, uh, arc, then they have the Greed Island arc, then the, uh, the Chimera Ant, whatever it is, um, arc that they do. So I guess that's what they're gonna do with the Pokemon anime. Maybe the, the anime starts off, um, in Alola, and then they travel to X and Y, and then the next arc is gonna be like that, and then it finishes off, uh, in Sword and Shield. That'd be really, really interesting to see, to be fair, but I just don't know how they're gonna play it. I couldn't see them... Like, what's the current, like, how many episodes is there in the Pokemon Sun and Moon anime? So how many episodes in Pokemon Sun and Moon anime? I'm interested to see. Oh, it says 43, but I know there's there's more than 43 here. Um, it started uh, November 17th. Okay. Pokemon Sun and Moon anime. Uh, it's saying 43, but I know there's more than 43. I know that it's 100% more than 43. I'm pretty confident there's more than 43. It's every... Oh, there's a Bulbapedia page here. I couldn't imagine, literally. Yeah, it says here that there's 141 episodes. It's um, Ash versus Kukui, yeah. Okay, so there's 141 episodes. So you try to imagine that they're going to make kind of like maybe the same, maybe 150 episodes um, for the Sun and Moon anime. I don't know if there's anything like confirmed. I do apologize. I... I, like I said, I've not been keeping up with the Sun and Moon anime, like, news and information. So, to me, it's all completely blank. I don't know nothing about it. Literally, I was trying to rewatch it, and the last news I saw that Ash won the league. So, it was one of those where I'm not 100%, like, hooked up on the information on it. So, if I say anything wrong, um, don't go too harsh on me in the comment section. It's just that I don't know about it. But that's why I wanted to get into this series of dropping more information about Sun and Moon anime. Uh, not the Sun and Moon, the Sword and Shield. It's one of those series where I've always been interested in the Pokemon series. Uh, and of course, always the animes are great. But I wanted to talk to you guys about it because I know there's a massive audience for the Pokemon anime here on YouTube. And I feel like if we have this series where each episode comes out weekly and, and we talk about it and we, you know, it's one of those where it, I feel like it'd be more enjoyable for me because you guys can give me more information. I can give you guys information about what's happening next. Because of course, things always happen like on the internet before and not a lot of people check up on it. So it's one of those where the series will... It, like, it'll come out every week, uh, and we'll talk about it. We'll have, like, information about it and stuff like that. So I'm really looking forward to it. I think it's going to be absolutely dope series. Uh, and, of course, like I said, there's a massive audience for it, and I know you guys love to watch it. But you guys will have to definitely let me know your thoughts on this down below in the comment section. What do you guys think to the poster? Is this going to be Ash's main rival, or is it going to be his companion throughout the anime? Of course, Ash has had different companions. And the fact that we're going back through the regions... So is Ash going to finally, like, meet up with Serena? Is he going to finally meet, like, with Clement and stuff like that? It's going to be so cool to see. He's going to see Dawn. He's going to see May. I hope to God, like, they all remember him and stuff like that. It's going to be so fun to see them actually going through the animes. Like, it really is. If it's set in each region and he's traveling through it, it's going to be so great to see him meet back up with his, like, his, his past friends and stuff like that. I hope they have, like, really good, like, we can see where Serena is now. Like, is she, like, with a contest, like, like, the best contest person in the world, I guess. Whatever, it's the best performer in the world, I guess. Um, so it's gonna be really interesting to see what they do with it. I, I, I have no idea what they're gonna do, but it'll be cool to see. So, if you guys are excited for it, of course, hit that thumbs up button. It is greatly, greatly appreciated. Let me know your thoughts on the poster down below in the comment section. Like I said, the series, as soon as we get more information regarding the anime, I will let you guys know. So if you are new around here, 
make sure to go ahead hit that subscribe button for me if you guys do want to keep up to date with all things on the pokemon anime i will be releasing videos every single week when we get new information for it it's one of those where i'm really looking forward to do it so of course i want you guys to be excited for it so hit that subscribe button it is greatly appreciated with all that being said i'm your friend thank you guys so much for watching hit that like button and i'll see you guys back in a brand new video next time bye